Yeah. But I think this is also an opportunity for anyone out there to write things down. Get lawyers involved to write things down so that if if it was written down mm. and one of the consequences is if you fail to give the money, you'd be put in prison mm. in that situation, yes. Mm. Think that is right. Forget about family in that situation. Mm. But if it's not written down, it can be a bit of a tricky one because now you're having to deal with a lot of family backlash. Mm. You're having to deal with a lot of family backlash and everything. And that can be quite tricky. But him being a businessman, if you're a businessman, I'm not going to lie to you, there's no, there's no, oh, you're of my family or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Business is business. <laughs> but if you're more of a humanist like I am, <laughs> you can add a bit of emotion into it and be like, ah. Oh. But was he right to send him to prison? Well, the thing is, in reality, he probably wouldn't go to prison for that long, depending on how much money, right? Mm. So I think it just <laughs> it, it could be good to like send a message like, look, I'm not playing around. Mm. Let him go to prison for even if it's one month or something, right? <laughs> and then maybe drop the charges in the future. This is not a joke, you know. I know, but uh, we wouldn't go to prison for this. Maybe jail. Wow. Maybe jail is a bit. Wow. Jail is a bit more PG. Wow. But, but anyways, if you if you if you think it was right. Yeah. Or you think it was wrong? Drop it in the comment section, cause actually, let me sorry, let me rephrase. I would call the police, but I wouldn't let my brother go to prison. Mm. You know what I mean? I'll call the police, get the police involved, and if to just to scare him, to rattle him a bit, and if it's something that can be resolved without him going to jail, I'll never let my brother go to jail. <laughs> you don't. You've already told us you let your brother go to jail. I'll call the police. Yes. Any of these bobbers that watch this, <laughs> you just remember. Go do your business. I'll never let him go to jail, but I'll call the police 100% when they had 100%. Wow. I'll, call the, I'll call the police. Wow. But then if, it, but if you call the police on your brother, mm. it's not going to be the same anymore. Why? Because he knows anytime, you, anytime situation like this happens, mm. you can always call police on him. Yeah. But also the relationship between you and him. Yeah, but it's, that, gonna be, it's never going to be the same once you're doing business together anyways. And it has to change for the business to prosper. It has to change. Mm. Come with doing family, 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 and business at the same time. Wow! You go, yeah, it's a fork in the road. You go, you go, take, take the, what? For me, I don't agree with the, the prison one. Ah, it's a bit too much. But either way, if an agreement was written down mm. and they said these are the consequences, and and that's the problem as well. A lot of the time, especially because of family, friends, we never write things down. Mm. We just assume that, oh, because I trust you, it's going to be fine. Mm. We need to start getting into a position where we start writing things down and people know the consequences of their actions. Yeah. Because if not, people will just be like, oh, yeah, I can do whatever I want. Yeah, yeah. Because of the culture we come from, they'll just be like, oh, once we begged him, that, oh, it's your brother, it's your sister, let him go. They'll just, nah. Mm. Things don't happen like that. But anyways, if you've got any more comments in that part, drop in the comment section. Let me go to scenario number two. This one. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I drove my guy to a place out of London to meet a girl as I knew he didn't drive. Mm. She had two other friends and I decided to call another guy to join us to make it three girls, three boys. We arrived at the location and everything was going well. The driver and the other person who was called last minute now saw the girl off, the two other girls off. So they were going home. The guy with the main girl was upstairs. So the driver decided to go and check if something was. So after seeing the girl off, the driver now decided to go upstairs to see if anything was happening between the main guy and the girl that the guy came to.